How's it going guys? I'm your host Karban Gaming. Welcome back to this week's AQ Nostalgia Quest episode and for today's episode I will be going through one of the past uh, anniversary events Rise of the Shadow Council and if I'm not wrong this is for their 13th anniversary I can't exactly remember but it does make sense uh, Maybe it's 13 or 14 I can't really remember but yeah anyways let's go through that Can you imagine how many years it has been already? Oh 2016 so 2016 was 7 years ago so I think this was 13, yeah. Ah, Korriban, chosen of Lord, just the person I needed to see. Really? Well, if you are looking for a fight, I'm ready. Don't let my appearance deceive you. I'm part of the Council of Lawmasters. Together, we have uncovered rumors that the tentacle of Karnax has been corrupted by something. We need a fearless hero to bring it back here for observation. Huh, okay, well, we have a problem. Karnax was defeated long ago and turned into stone. It's a big attraction for the kids these days. We are aware of Karnax's defeat, but time is not a hindrance for us. If what has been whispered is true, then we are all in grave danger. A great evil looms on the horizon, and we need your help if you are going to conquer whatever it may be. I can send you back to the time when Karnax roamed the lands, but you must bring back a piece of its tentacle for our analysis. I'm all for time travel, and I'll be glad to help, on one condition, which is... Can you please not use some moody portal that really relishes in like electrocuting me? Never mind, I'll take on your task and return with the tentacle of Carnex. By the way, I just wanted to say that uh, the reason you're seeing my default face, weapon, and shield is because there's this weird bug. Every time you uh, sort out your inventory, sometimes this happens, and the same goes for the infinite player loading bug. Like These are two very, very annoying bugs in the game that I hope that the devs can fix. Uh, it doesn't happen all the time, so it's not like you can replicate it 100%, but it happens often enough that it is annoying, and it usually happens after an inventory sort. I don't know what causes this, uh, so yeah, hopefully the devs can fix this. You are indeed a hero of legend, Korriban. Remember, you must retrieve the tentacle before the beasts turn into stone. Hmm, well, I guess this is the right place. Oh, uh, this should be easy. There we go. Whoa, that was close. This is definitely the right spot. I'm going to have to join the battle if I'm going to get close enough to try and get one of those tentacles. Alright, let's fight. So we yeah, have six or eight battles, I think. And then... I think that's it. Yeah. Okay, the infinite loading bug again. Alright, I'm going to pause here and we'll be right back. So yeah guys, speak of the freaking devil, I don't, yeah, the bug just occurred again. I literally don't know what causes it, but please, please freaking fix that crap. Okay, so here we have the right leg of Karnak, so let's go ahead and get our stuff ready. Uh, she is, what's Eternal Champion, and let's start. Okay, so we want to nuke it with wind, but I think you can do it with anything else. Let me go Shadow Feeder. Uh, zero intellect, so this should be easy for Shadow Feeder to inflict. Uh, yep. This is just a regular monster, not a boss monster or anything. Yeah, I'm gonna try and nuke this guy down because uh, there really isn't much to this boss. Yeah, I think we'll nuke with... Uh, probably Darkness. Darkness will work better. Wait, no. Never mind, we'll stick with fire. Yeah, there's no lucky strike stopping it or whatever. Uh, uh, let's do that and let's do... Uh, what do I want to do here? Power gauntlet. Oh, he endured. Damn it. Okay, shadow feeder. Three rounds. Okay. I'm gonna switch into Spell Slinger. Oh no, not this. Uh, this one. Wait, uh, Spell... Okay, we'll just amplify our spell and then we'll do Rending Chill as well. Okay, let's do Destruction Burst. Great damage. Okay, we'll switch back into Fortune Teeth over here. And then we'll have Win. What do you have for Win? Uh, big Dictionary, right? It's our Win weapon. Wait. Okay, you know what? Instead of this, I think we just attack with Hexbound. Maybe we do PCO. Yeah, I should have done that earlier. Oopsies. Ok, 
Okay, Storm. There we go. Literally no damage. Let's go back to this. And we can destruction burst. Okay. It's pretty good. I think it's a full heal after every two battles. So yeah, after this battle we still got one more. Uh it's not difficult, just very tanky, so yeah. It's quite a lot of HP to get through here. Nice. Maybe you should switch to something other than Hex Bow. Let's regen something. Uh, Darkness is 100. Maybe we can do... Oh no, Infinity We didn't bring out Infinity, I forgot. Oh well. It's okay. Yeah, I should be using Thunder instead. Forgot. Uh, let's do... Do I... Do I not have Thunder here? Uh, for some weird reason, I don't. Cometoid Jelly This won't be that good because it's only 80% but whatever Have him heal uh, MP Oh nice, very nice All 4 crits, I love that Would have been higher if uh, he didn't actually have that much uh, Ice resist yeah. Okay, that's still pretty good Uh, the burn from Hexbound Prominence is really hurting me, but it's okay. I think we'll still survive fine. Uh, I'm gonna take this chance to heal up. There we go. Okay, next right arm of Carnex. This one also hits it up, so let's get started. Uh, I'm gonna do Essence Orb. Oh, HP is a little low though, so gotta be careful on that. Uh, but let me try Power Gauntlet first. Nope, that was a waste. Damage, Shadow Feeder. Only two clicks. Okay, maybe you can go for one more click. Okay, we got it. Uh, what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna use optical. Have this heal my SP, and then we'll go into this. Uh, bring up Polala. Uh, what is this week too? Okay, so we want water or ice. Alright. Water ice or wind? Okay, let's do wind then. Uh, Polala. Uh, do this. Okay. Pretty good. Oh, this one doesn't have as much HP. Okay, okay, that's great. Switch back to our jelly. And dismiss this guess. And doesn't matter what we use, I don't know, but I'm gonna switch to this instead. And I'm going to drink a HP pot just to make sure I don't die. 522 barrier. Yeah, I don't think I will die. Okay, so I just smack him with win, I think. Uh Which one is the efficient one? I think it's this one. Yeah, okay, we just do the efficient spell. Regen. Oh, very nice heal. Okay. Uh, it's gonna do the SP attack next turn, which I don't know what it is, but I don't want to find out, so what I'm going to do is... I am going to... Do I still have celerity? No, no more celerity. Let's go for one more round, just in case. Okay, I think you should be able to kill him. Pixel either. Two clicks. Yep, that should be enough. 
spell, sorry, what? Teleport pool? There we go. Alright, and we should get a full heal now. Back of Carnex, 24,000. Okay, here we go again. Let's go, guys. Uh... Ah, 24,000. <laughs> this is really annoying to deal with. Okay. Let's just go all out and burst him down. Shall we try... Please work. Power gondolet. Come on. Ah, he keeps resisting the power gondolet. Damn it. Oh, wait, what? How is he able to resist everything? What the heck? Okay, so um, water, wind or ice? Ooh, ice will be really good here, but damn. Okay, so I think you can rely on Comatoid Jelly for the healing, but... What in the world? How do he resist all my Shadow Feeder Pendant procs? Okay, what level is he? Level 150. Yeah, he shouldn't be able to. Uh, I guess I was just really, really unlucky. Okay, two rounds, whatever. I'm gonna take that. Polala. Bring up Polala as well. PCO for the damage boost. And we're going to do... Water. Okay, let's do water. Teleport boost. Let's go. Okay, not bad, not bad. Uh, let's bring out Comitoid Jelly. For the heal, optical, yeah, this should heal a fat amount, really, really fat amount. I'm just gonna spam this. And yeah, watch the crazy heals, guys. 325. Keep in mind, zero charisma here, just luck. Full luck build. Okay, uh, I think we'll switch over to MP. Do we have enough to sustain? I think we'll have. Yeah, I think I'll probably have enough to sustain it. Uh, when we can do the efficient one. 746, that's pretty good. For an efficient spell. 227. Okay, if it, everything landed, it'll be great. But no, not everything landed. Okay. Let's use some MP. Nice. Yeah, what the heck? Okay, so just weird tentacles, I guess. Two sixty-seven. Yeah, I guess we can just keep spamming the spells. Two ten. 130, okay. That hurt a little. Oh, come on, miss. Seriously. Okay, I'm gonna drink a health pot here just to make sure I don't die to anything silly. Oh, very nice. 1,000 lucky gas. That, that is crazy. That is crazy. Oh, wow. That hit hard. That hit really hard. Okay. Uh, we try and shadow feed a few more turns. Let's see if we get lucky here. No. What? You are kidding me, right? Not even one? Really? Oh, come on, I need a faster heal than that. Okay, 2 out of 4 is not bad. The thing is, this burst spell drains my HP as well. That's why my HP is going down so fast. Every time I cast it, I'm taking a hit to my HP.
Oh, very nice. Wow. 1,000 just from the lucky guy. Okay, and you know what? Honestly, I think we can just call off the Polala. I guess it's just wasting my mana for no reason. Okay. Just back into empty heal. Oh, three hits. If we only landed the fourth one, that could have been like 300 plus MP heal. Ah, only one lucky shot. There. Fission spell might have done it, but whatever. Okay, next one. Left leg of Carnex. Ooh, another one with a fat HP bar. 14,000. Okay. Ah, it's not that good this time, but uh, still win. Win will do good here. Uh, I'm gonna chug an MP pot. Yeah, that's not gonna stop. Oops, forgot to equip optical. Still managed to get one lucky shot off by itself, which is really nice. Shadow feeder. Ah, uh, missing 3 SP. Okay, whatever. At least we got lucky on the first cast. I think I will not bother with Power Gondot because normally it just doesn't work against Carnex. I don't know why. I think because I'm very unlucky. I can't remember what the stat rolls are to be honest. Uh, missing 3 SP for one more cast. Okay. Okay, nice. Got it. Damage. And then we can switch over to this. Oh la la. Uh, shall we try haunting? I feel like haunting could be good here. Let's try haunting, shall we? Can't kill us all. Haunting, um, grand? Okay, we'll do the regular one. Like, grand isn't really the best way to use the mana. Okay, that is pretty good. Switch back to fortune thief. Dismiss this. Coming toy out. Uh, we we'll have a heal MP. Yeah, that's what we'll do. So we have enough to keep spamming. And then on our second turn, we will chuck HP pots. 300. Ooh, that's actually really good. Okay, that is literally almost all of our mana. That was used the previous turn. Awesome. Okay, got two more rounds. Fortune Thief. One fifty. Oh, come on, stop missing two two five. Maybe heal SP the next turn. Okay. Can we try Destruction Burst? Uh, no. Cre uh, Arctic Tornado would be better here. Let's do that. Okay. Why is it so weak? I expected a bit more, but it's okay. Uh, let's heal up here. Oh, nice.
Okay, I like that. 5,000 health. Yeah, uh, this this battle is a freaking slog. Like it's it's not difficult, it's just really really annoying. Yeah, really annoying. Because of how much HP it has. I mean, if you want to do some insane stacking, you can and literally just like one shot it or something, but I'm not doing that, so yeah. G68, very nice. Ooh, let's have a heal HP instead. Ah, last hit always miss. Damn. Oh, lucky gas. Oh, the lucky gas has been really lucky today. All of it has been lucky strike so far. Yeah, I think I'm just very lucky that. Awesome. Uh. I'm gonna do this because I don't think the efficient one is enough. Ah, still not enough. Really? Come on. I'm gonna drink an MP pot. Uh, the next one should be the last battle, I think. There we go. Alright, right arm. I can't remember if there's a hit, hit battle, but yeah, let's just start. Oh, full heal, wait. Okay, so yeah, there probably is a hit battle after this then. Uh, two rounds. See, you can get more. <laughs> okay, guess you only have time for one quest today. Uh, I was not expecting this to be that long, to be honest. Oh, but this one doesn't have that much HP though. Okay, so it should go down to New King pretty quickly. Good to know, good to know. Why is he weak to uh win? Okay, we can do win. Take tornado. And then go back to this. Dismiss. I'm gonna toy out. Okay, nice. Didn't even get a turn. Back of Carnex again. Got damn it. Uh, this should be the last one, I think. Hopefully, it's the last one. Oh my God. Yeah, man, this is such an annoyingly long fight. I mean, I could do all the crazy boosting. Uh, but I don't. Do I have all the right gear here? Maybe you can try that. Yeah, we can try that. The the risky method, shall we? Okay, so we try to get. Oh my god! Wow, that is so unlucky. What? Shall we try this again? Okay, wow, it finally worked. Nice. Nice to see that finally worked, but unfortunately, Shadow Feeder Pendant didn't even work once, so that is very unfortunate. Come on, Shadow Feeder Pendant. Three rounds. Okay, you know what? I, I will take the three rounds. Yeah, I'll take that. Now we go all out and nuke. Okay, Polala. I don't have a nuking weapon or a nuking shield. It, it could be further boosted if I wanted to, but I didn't do enough prep for this. I didn't realize. Okay, water, wind, or ice. Oh, darkness is also 140. Hmm. Uh, I think water is the best here because water has 4 hits. Yeah, I have 4 hits in the teleport booth. Oh, very nice. Sick. That is some sick damage. Okay, uh... Oh, yeah. This is gonna heal me a ton. A fat ton. Okay, uh, I'm gonna have it heal MP, and then what we can do is I'm going to chuck a HP pot over here. Oh my god, 66. That is crazy. Okay, 
Unfortunately, not as many lucky strikes as I would like, but can you imagine if we got more? That would be crazy. Yeah, it's a huge pain to have to keep resummoning everything every single time. I know, I know, but <laughs> it is what it is. Uh, let's see, teleport booth again. No lucky strikes, okay. Miss Optical and I'm gonna chug a HP pot just in case. Ah, stop missing. Only 72 MRM, how does it keep missing? I don't understand. Ah, okay. Last round of New King. I think it should be more than halfway down by then. That took about four to five thousand HP off him, so that's actually really good. And then water, wind, ice. Okay. Oh, shall we do ice? Let's let's try space feral. Yeah, let's have fun with space feral. Oh, okay. See, so you can try to freeze him. He's not immune or anything, so I think we have a good shot. Have him heal SP. Endures the chilling cold, damn it. What does it save against? I think it's endurance if I'm not mistaken. It makes sense to be endurance. If it's endurance then there's no way I'm freezing him. But let's see. No, he keeps enduring. That's so annoying. Yeah, but by now my range weapon damage will have already exceeded that of a warrior damage. So using range weapons now when I'm out of MP is actually pretty good. It keeps resisting the the freeze effect. Damn it! Okay, let's go back to spell casting. Okay, let's have it heal our HP instead. Uh, come on, no freeze. Water, water is only spear of all. That's not really fun. Wind, ah, uh, yeah, wind's not really fun either. This is the fun one, but the thing is, it's so hard to get it to work. Like on paper, it's actually really good, but in order to get it to work, it's so difficult. Oh, nice, one thousand. <laughs> Guys, that is some sick damage. And Dio again, damn it. I think we can HP PK him at this rate. It's just not moving. Uh come on. Disgusting. Twelve two to eighty-eight. Okay. Without any boosters, by the way. Let's try and boost it with Thunder. I don't think it'll make a big difference. Spring of Thunder. Okay, maybe a very, very slight boost. I don't know, I can't tell. Uh, 27.8%. Oh, okay, actually, it should be noticeable. Yeah, I think it's noticeable. It's just that the, the damage range is a bit huge. Okay, another one. Uh, we got another full heal. Alright, let's go again. Alright, Lake of Carnex. 13,000 health. Uh, okay. Boy, this is a lot longer quest than I remember. Yeah, what the heck? Why is this quest so freaking long? What the hell? Uh, please work. Yes! Okay, win. Okay, we hit him with win. Please, come on. Two rounds. Try and get more. Thirteen thousand. Not not at uh half as tanky as the back, but still pretty tanky. Okay. Uh, shadow feeder. I think you can do four clicks. Let's go. 
okay, only got four rounds after all of that work, but whatever. Oh, this is a really freaking annoyingly long quest. Uh, what do I want to hit him with again? Win, right? Yeah, okay, win. Arctic tornado, go do your thing. Okay, 2.8k damage. Not too bad, not too bad. Okay, we'll have you heal our SP. Okay, do this. Okay. Not as much as Arctic Tornado, but I'll take it. Oh, come on. Oh yeah, that's what I'm talking about. 433. Basically, heal back all the SP that I needed. Awesome. Oh, all four crits. Wow, 400 plus heal. That's crazy. Okay. I think we can just do Arctic Tornado like that. Yeah. Yeah, that's still pretty good. And we got the beat as well. Oh, lucky gas. Bro, what? Okay, today all of our lucky gases have really been super lucky. Wow, damn. And holy moly. Over half an hour long already. I really was not expecting this episode to be that long. Are you kidding me? Come on, dude. Oh lord, back of Karnex again. I think we fought. This should be the last one. Should be the last one. Please let it be the last one. Ah, oh, god damn it. <laughs> so we fought the right arm, left arm, right leg, and left leg. Right, and I think we fought the back like what, four times? Or something at this point, so yeah. Holy jeez. That's crazy. Oh! Why did I do that? Ah! Misclick. No, oh, I don't need freaking donuts. I need damage. Ah, okay, nice. That worked. Ellie Vaughn worked. Uh, two turns. You get more turns. Well, you don't have to MP. Damn. Okay, guess I have to chuck some MP pods. Only three rounds, seriously. Whatever. Get a free shield. Uh, take, bring an optical and we chug an MP pot here. I think we drink one more. Oh wait, no, this is overkill. Wait, hold on, this is overkill. Oh, that was a waste. Yeah, that was a waste. My bad. Okay, never mind. Yup, that was a huge waste. Oops, a daisy. Okay, water, wind, ice. Switch it to SP. Cast the water spell here. Let's do that. Take full advantage of that damage boost while it's here anyway. I think we should still be able to survive, yeah. Still have the barrier up, so I'm not too worried, okay? Okay, let's healing back all our SP, which is great. Okay, one more turn of celerity. I think I'll bit heal MP. Let's have it do damage. Yes, no more misclicking. Nice. Okay. 
Maybe I should get it to heal HP. Yeah, HP is looking a little dangerous here. Even with the barrier. Two hundred, nice. Auto wind ice, okay. One seventy seven. Forty eight. Oh, that was pathetic. Okay, uh, now I think we just play around with the ranged weapon. Yeah. See if we can get manage to land a freeze on him. I don't know if he's immune or what. Probably is immune, something to do with the Carnex tag making him immune, even though we don't see any extra bonus tags here on the side. That's my guess. Guess you can use Thunder for more damage. Oh! Oh wait, hold on a minute. Never mind, I changed my mind. Uh, looks like it worked. Okay, awesome. Uh, awesome. Okay, hexbound. Hexbound prominence. Uh, it should do a lot of damage, right? Yeah, that's pretty good damage. Okay, back to. Space Ferris Frost Cannon. Yeah, it's just a very, very low chance. I think we are just very unlucky. <laughs> Should I just try and nuke with the spell? Yeah, this is way too slow. I think maybe I'll just try and nuke with the spell or something. Okay, water. Yes. I really gotta watch my HP when casting all these burst spells. <coughs> 1.8k left. Come on. I think we just try and finish it like this. The regular weapon. The pet heal the MP at the same time. Okay, I think I have enough for one more cast. It's just enough. Barely. There we go. Please tell me that's the last one. Oh god, that was so long. Oh my god. Yeah, not a lot of battles. It's just that the battles are freaking tedious as heck. Don't even get to fight the hit. Okay, not that I want to fight the hit. <laughs> because fighting the back four times, yeah, that is super annoying. I fail you, my master. Death has come. My nightmare ends. I can rest finally. Rest. You can't reach me now. I am free. I hate interrupting a death scene, but I need just a teensy be bit of your time. Promise you won't even know I'm here. Alright, now to get out of here. And there we go. Ah, Korriban, you return and I see you've brought the tentacle we required. I was almost trampled to death, but yes, I returned with the tentacle. Hmm, it is clear this item is tainted. It pulses with dark power and must be quarantined. I know of a location which is specially spelled for things like this and it is closely guarded. They will keep it safe while it's investigated. Thank you, Korriban. I must make haste if we are to uncover this corruption. It seems like your trip back in time had its side effects. The gear you previously acquired from defeating Carnex has somehow changed. Okay, uh, let's see what we have here for the reward after that super duper lengthy quest. Weapons. We have the Ultra Omni Knight Blade. Okay, so this is one of the best weapons in South Dragon Fable. Unfortunately, in South Adventure Quest, uh, it certainly looks a lot nicer with the glow and all that, but you can only change it between melee and magic, and you can change it between water and ice. That is literally it. Very, very boring, nothing special, just a compression item. And then you have the Time Twister Eye of Carnex. This one, uh, I think you switch between fire and energy, I can't really remember, but yeah, these items aren't that great. This one, I think it probably comes with a skill. The, the artwork looks really nice, so I'm really digging it. I wish that 
green was the main color rather than the gold because the main color of Carnex is green rather than gold so I think that makes a bit more sense in my opinion even though his armor is gold but yeah I like the artwork a lot but I don't think this is a useful item so I'm going to pass on it and that's going to do it for today's lengthy video guys hope you guys have enjoyed the episode of VIP sure give this video a thumbs up and of course subscribe to this channel if you guys would like to see more of such future content till the next time I'm your host Carbon Gaming peace out